I get to play with fire. <laughs> Derek <so> Johnson <laughs> with the Quirkles is here. Good to see you. Good as to always. see you, Tom. Remind Thank folks you. who the Quirkles are. The Quirkles is a 26-book science literacy series that integrates the two topics. Mm -hmm. It's a fun way to get kids involved in science. It is. I've seen you work with the kids at the Storm Academy. Yes. They love it. And we're going to cover another topic, and it's all about pressure, pressure right? Pressure, right. And we did some of these at the Storm Academy, but I'm going to give you a break today, Tom. I'm not going to make you put on the shower cap. So. Yeah, that I, yeah. <laughs> I appreciate that part. So we're going to, our first experiment, we're going to try, clearly, this egg does not fit into the bottle. As not is. whole, yes. Not whole, <laughs> not as is. You know, you can use this question. Yes, but we don't I want scrambled it. eggs. We, right. want, we want whole eggs. Okay. So we're going to figure out a way that we can make that happen. Mm -hmm. Now, before we start, I want to preface that we are using fire. That's right. And it is one for adults to do. Children should absolutely not be doing this at home. That's right. I, I cannot much. preface that enough. Mm -hmm. Okay, Tom, because you're so excited about this, I would like for you to just take the end, hold the strip of paper, okay. just light it on fire, and drop it in the bottle. Make sure you have a pretty decent flame. And okay. then we're going to put the egg on well, top. Now let's see, we've got a lock going here. Where we'll do we just, go? Yeah, here, just here, actually. See, I can't even operate the thing. Oh, there, there we go. go. All right. All right. right. I'll now. let you do it. See, that's probably okay. the safer way. Now, drop it. Okay. Drop it in. Yeah. We're going to put the egg on. And... Boop! Ooh. Bah! Okay. How about that? Now How about that? Look at it. Wait a minute. Okay, good. Yes. But you see? The, that? Yeah, the egg is in see the bottle. See the egg in there? Ha-ha! <laughs> Now, what, what was going on there, oh, Tom? Oh, there's is, more to go. Yeah, well, oh, I well, thought we'd well, kind of yeah. done the whole thing there. <laughs> well, now you get to get it out, Tom. That's the fun part. No, uh, no, I won't make you do that. Actually, there is a way, but it's kind of gross, so I won't yeah, make you I don't do that. Go there but what was happening there, Tom, is the, the, as we were heating up the molecules, mm -hmm. they expand. Right. Some of them even came out. Yes. At, when the fire went out, the air contracted which it lowered the air the pressure, pressure and mm -hmm. the high air pressure rushed in, tried to rush in, could yeah. not get in because of the egg and pushed the egg. And when something goes out, nature wants to balance by bringing something back in. So that's that was the egg in that very case. Very good, very good. So okay. that's a fun thing to do with your Easter eggs after Easter. Right. You know, you can get a milk But bottle. again, parents, not kids. Right, right. Cannot stress that All right. enough. Uh, I just wanted to show you we're not going to do it, but that same experiment can be done with a balloon. So okay. if teachers wanted to not use the egg, because those bottles are kind of hard to find now, that's just an old-fashioned milk bottle. Absolutely. Actually, I ordered that from a science company. But mm -hmm. this is an easier way to do it, just with a mason jar, and you can right. do that with the balloon. So it'll so still I just, work, right? It will still work. The balloon will go down in. So I just wanted okay. to make sure teachers saw that. But This is the part that scares me now. Because, okay. Yeah, now, that's what this, you, this is the, the thing that's about right. the shower This cap. is Tom's favorite. He loves this experiment. It is absolutely his favorite. Now, Tom, I have a screen screen on mm -hmm. this jar just so I want to make sure the TV audience can see. Okay. Clearly any science ninny knows that if you turn a, a jar of water upside down with the screen that the water's going to fall out. Absolutely. Correctly. I'm going to put this card. What does this card say, Tom? Do not remove Do this not card. Do not remove this card. Yeah, it's the, you, you get know, those on mattresses. That's, yeah, that's right, which I always <laughs> remove, but that's okay. Uh, that's so okay, so we are going to take this. Yeah. We're going to turn it upside down. Okay. We're going to put the card there. Uh-huh. And then I'm going to let it stay. It worked. That doesn't. It worked. Yeah. Now, now wait a minute. Part you know, it said do not remove the card, but yes. I want to remove the card. All right. Just for fun, let's remove it. You're nervous, Tom? Yeah, I was nervous before when I had the shower this curtain. This was over And Tom's that was head, over my by head. Way, that's right. So I'm going to slowly remove the card. And... How about voila. them apples? Voila. Now, I'm going to take it, tilt it. Yep. And as soon as you do it, there it is. That's so right. you know now, that's all legit. That's right. Now, you had two things going on there, Tom. Right. You had air pressure mm -hmm. was pushing up on the water harder than gravity was pushing down. Right. But you also had a thing called surface tension that was playing with the molecules on the water were sticking together, and that's why it stuck to the wire net. It's all part of the quirkles. That's of course, right. you can find more on, more on OzarksFirst.com. Where can they find all the books. Uh, they can find them at IPA, they can find them at Gold Mines, they can find them at Anna Sophia's, and on our website, Quirkles.com. There you go. Terry, thanks for It's always fun, Tom. It was a lot of fun. Time. I enjoyed yes. that. It was thanks. pretty